Hi you guys, welcome back to Bright Violet Arts. My name is Valerie and in the video today I'm going to be showing you guys my planning setup and my illustrations for my bullet journal for the month of September 2023. Uh, this video is going to be a little bit different. Um, I lost the footage that I took of my art process and you know setting up the actual pages. Uh, so what I've done is I filmed a pretty short flip through of all the pages I made that I lost the footage for and once we take a look at that I'm gonna set up the last and final review page for the month on camera uh, with you guys in this video so I hope you enjoy the process this is my September cover page it's supposed to look like you know like a window looking out onto a desert scene because I did want to do a desert uh, theme this month and I love the quote uh, look for proof that you're amazing I actually <laughs> I got it from a fortune cookie um, honestly and it just I don't know it spoke to me I, I really liked it so it was a good one for September and then the second page I've just multicolored the boxes for the dates and for my tasks and habits page along with the illustration I've added some like gold foiled washi tape that has little desert plants and you know assorted cacti uh, in a pattern on it this is my mood and productivity tracker um, this is my most important tracker I think um, and I especially love the way it looks when it's all filled out at the end of the month so I really try hard to keep up with both of those uh, trackers each day uh, moving on to the weeklies this is uh, kind of a, a different shape for me. I don't usually start with round art in the center, but I, I like the idea of having um, a central illustration this time, so I gave it a shot. And uh, this is one of those bizarre plants that grows in the desert. I live in the desert myself, actually, in the southwestern United States, and we have plants like this um, in, in people's yards around here, and they shoot up these great big spikes with blooms on them like that. Um, when they're when they're in season this was my favorite page from the whole month just because I thought the illustration was so sweet for some reason I think I think it's because I just really liked the way the sunset looked in the background I did that with a um, a couple of Tombow markers and then I think everything else was either a mild liner or a super tip um, for the rest of these markers um, I, there's a couple of uh, various brands of highlighters but it was all just like water based markers and highlighters for um, the supplies this month for coloring so this is going to be the last page of the month i'm going to set it up as a review page um, with like space for memories and some free journaling but i'm going to start it off with an illustration and this will just demonstrate um, basically like what i was talking about with like the various types of highlighters and super tips and stuff that I used to get this color palette. I kind of just pulled um, a couple of markers, it seemed like, from all my different you know, marker and highlighter collections. Um, I wasn't really consistent with one brand or one type. I did switch over from markers to a olive green fine liner here to do the spines on the cactus, and I made them just sort of like little like V shapes or star shapes depending on what part of the cactus they were sitting on you know to to try to make it look round and then I did some various details uh, on this other cactus here but with the same olive green fine liner for the opposite page I'm gonna leave some space to put in just some memories from the month and I'm using a Tombow, the thin tip on a Tombow, just to outline those, those letters. I'm also going to leave space for a song of the month, like just whatever I'm listening to on repeat, you know, during, during the weeks of September. And uh, a spot for uh, like little wins, you know, just small successes that I want to remember. And the last little section here is for in the news. It's just for current events 
and uh, I'm just gonna add my highlighters to you know produce the lines to write on I'm alternating those colors and uh, again I don't know if I already said this but these highlighters most of them came from the uh, neutral colors pack of the zebra mild liners I did want to spruce up the illustration so I'm gonna add some more of that translucent washi tape I'm gonna add a few different um, colors here in like little overlapping stripes which is nice because it you know creates a new color where the translucent tapes blend um, it's a really pretty effect I've really enjoyed these um, nice neutral washi tapes but so I'm gonna lay them down here and then trim them up and then I'm gonna come back in with my craft knife uh, my exacto knife here and just trim around the illustration uh, wherever the washi tape covers the marker and then once I peel that off it gives it a very nice interesting look I think to have the washi right up against the illustration itself All right, so that is the uh, completed setup for September. I'm gonna flip through it one more time to close out this video. Um, you can find me on Instagram at Bright Violet Arts if you'd like to see more of my journaling and illustration over there. And I will be back again soon with more videos. Feel free to hit me up with a comment if you have any questions or uh, any comments about today's video or the supplies or anything like that. Um, otherwise, I hope you guys have a great month. I hope that September treats everybody very well and that I will see you again soon on my next Plan With Me video. So until next time, thank you again for checking out Bright Violet Arts and I will see you again soon. Happy journaling.